everybody. This is my new project. I call it Mobile Relays. It's made by an Arduino here, connected to uh, an Ethernet module based on the uh, ENC 28J60 chip from Microchip, an SD card module, and a relay module. Both the Ethernet module and the SD card module are connected to the Arduino through the SPI bus. They share three pins of the bus, the master out slave in, the master in slave out and the clock, while the fourth pin, the chip select, must be unique for each module. This is the reason why I'm not using uh, the shields, because uh, the SD card shield and the Ethernet shield I own uses the same uh, chip select pin, so they cannot work together. And so I was forced to use external model. This is basically the same setup of my previous example. And the Arduino, using the Ethernet card shield, publishes a website, uh, the resources of uh, which are stored in the SD card. I connected the Arduino to my laptop. So using a serial mo monitor, I can see what is happening in the sketch. And I call it SD card um, mobile switch because the web page, now I can use, oops, password. I can use my smartphone to run a web browser, open a new page, and connect to the IP address of the Arduino that is displayed in the serial monitor. Okay, just type the address. Okay, let's see what's happening. As you can see, Arduino is sending to the browser the resources it requests. Okay, and the web page is displayed in the browser. I can switch the relay on and off with just one click. You can hear the sound of the relay while it's switching. And again, and of course, every time I click the button on the serial monitor, I can see what's happening in the sketch. Just to prove it's working, let's move here. And you can see that okay guys thanks for watching and enjoy your Arduino